The future simple tense. Will, shall. Function of the simple future tense. The simple future refers to a time later than now and expresses fact or certainty. In this case, there is no attitude. The simple future is used to predict a future event. It will rain tomorrow, with I or we to express a spontaneous decision. I will pay for the tickets by credit card. To express willingness, I will do the washing up. He will carry your bag for you. In the negative form, to express unwillingness. The baby won't eat his soup. I won't leave until I have seen the manager. With I in the interrogative form, using shall to make an offer. Shall I open the window? With we in the interrogative form, using shall to make a suggestion. Shall we go to the cinema tonight? With I in the interrogative form, using shall to ask for advice or instructions. What shall I tell the boss about this money? With you to give orders. You will do exactly as I say. With you in the interrogative form to give an invitation. Will you come to the dance with me? Will you marry me? Note. In modern English, will is preferred to shall. Shall is mainly used with I and we to make an offer or suggestion, to ask for advice. With the other persons, you, he, she, they, shall is only used in literally or poetic situation. For example, with rings on her fingers and bells on her toes, she shall have music wherever she goes. Forming the simple future The simple future tense is composed of two parts, will, shall, plus infinitive without to. Positive I will go, I shall go. Negative They will not see, they won't see. Interrogative Will she ask? Interrogative negative. Won't they try? Contraction. I will. I'll. We will. Will. You will. You. He will. He'll. She will. She'll. They will. They'll. Will not. Won't. The form it will is not normally shortened. To see. Simple future tense. Positive. I will see. Negative. I won't see. Interrogative. Will I see? Interrogative negative. Won't I see? I shall see. Shall I see? You will see. You won't see. Will you see? Won't you see? He will see. He won't see. Will he see? Won't he see? We will see. We won't see. Will we see? Won't we see? We shall see. Shall we see? They will see. They won't see. Will they see? Won't they see? Shall is dated but it is still commonly used instead of will, with a positive or interrogative form of I and we in certain cases. See above. Use one. Will to express a voluntary action. Will often suggests that a speaker will do something voluntarily. A voluntary action is one the speaker offers to do for someone else. Often we use will to respond to someone else complaint or request for help. We also use will when we request 
that someone help us or volunteer to do something for us. Similarly, we use will not or won't when we refuse to voluntarily do something. Examples I will send you the information when I get it. I will translate the email so Mr. Smith can read it. Will you help me move this heavy table? Will you make dinner? I will not do your homework for you. I won't do all the housework myself. A. I am really hungry. B. I'll make some sandwiches. A. I'm so tired. I'm about to fall asleep. B. I'll get you some coffee. A. The phone is ringing. B. I'll get it. Used to. Will to express a promise. Will is usually used in promises. Examples. I will call you when I arrive. If I am elected President of the United States, I will make sure everyone has access to inexpensive health insurance. I promise I will not tell him about the surprise party. Don't worry, I will be careful. I won't tell anyone your secret. You three. Be going to, to express a plan. Be going to, expresses that something is a plan. It expresses the idea that a person intends to do something in the future. It doesn't matter whether the plan is realistic or not. He is going to spend his vacation in Hawaii. She is not going to spend her vacation in Hawaii. A. When are you going to meet each other tonight? B. We are going to meet at 6 p.m. I am going to be an actor when I grow up. Michelle is going to begin medical school next year. They are going to drive all the way to Alaska. Who are you going to invite to the party? A. Who is going to make John's birthday cake? B. Sue is going to make John's birthday cake. Use for. Will or be going to to express a prediction. Both will and be going to can express the idea of a general prediction about the future. Prediction are guesses about what might happen in the future. In prediction sentences, the subject usually has little control over the future and therefore uses one till three do not apply. In the following examples there is no difference in meaning. Example The year 2222 will be a very interesting year. The year 2222 is going to be a very interesting year. John Smith will be the next president. John Smith is going to be the next president. The movie The Knit will win several Academy Awards. The movie The Knit is going to win several Academy Awards. Use 5. Will to express opinion with I think, I don't think, probably, I'm sure, I wonder, I expect. Examples I'll probably be at home late this evening. I haven't seen Carol today. I expect she will phone me this evening. Don't worry about exams. I'm sure you will pass. I don't think the exam will be very difficult. I wonder what will happen. Important in the simple future, it's not always clear which use the speaker has in mind. Often there is more than one way to interpret a sentence meaning. No future in time closes. 
Like all future forms, the simple future cannot be used in clauses beginning with the expression such as when, while, before, after, by the time, as soon as, if, unless, etc. Instead of simple future, simple present is used. Examples When you will arrive tonight, we will go out for dinner. Not correct. When you arrive tonight, we will go out for dinner. Correct. Adverb placement The examples below show the placement for grammar adverbs such as always, only, never, ever, still, just, etc. Examples You will never help him. Will you ever help him? You are never going to meet Jane. Are you ever going to meet Jane? Active passive Examples John will finish the work by 5 p.m. Active The work will be finished by 5 p.m. Passive Sally is going to make a breakfast dinner tonight. Active a beautiful dinner is going to be made by Sally tonight. Passive. Now let's get down to practice. I will finish my report later today. The sun will rise at 6.03 a.m. I'll go to the market tomorrow. There will be another conference next month. I'll come to see you on Sunday. We will be back on Friday afternoon. Tom will visit his parents next week. They will paint the fence blue. I will return in two hours. He will finish his homework in 20 minutes. Jane will turn 18 this year. The wedding will take place on May 8th. The ceremony will begin at 4 p.m., followed by a meal and a big party. Note, in certain situation, we use will to emphasize. You will drink your milk. I will find a job. Will you go shopping? I will not permit that kind of behavior. Will our teacher come with us? Yes, he will. No, he won't. Our teacher won't come with us. Let's have some trial tests now. A. What would you like to eat? B. A sandwich, please. I have. Now you have to choose right answer. A. I'm going to have. B. I'll have. C. I have. D. I'm having. E. I have had.